It's strange not being able to gather in church over Easter. Normally people look for God in sacred places. But remember Jesus' ministry was in everyday places, in meeting people wherever they were, in the open air, on the seashore, on a hillside, in people's houses and often around a table, sharing food with a wide variety of people and often those who were undervalued, a bit like today's key workers who shared Christ's humility and service in putting others first. Tonight, Maundy Thursday, the night before he dies, we remember Jesus gathered his disciples together at a table one last time, the Last Supper. Jesus breaks bread for a broken community. He wasn't breaking bread for an assembly of heroes, but for a fragile, confused group of followers. Fast forward 2,000 years and nothing much has changed. We talk of the celebration of the Last Supper, but what is there to celebrate? Because if Jesus was only offering his disciples a share in his anguish and worry, then it doesn't sound much of a celebration to me. No, the good news is Jesus pays the bill. And not just for tonight's meal. He tells his followers, because of the people he cherished and the values he stood for, because of who he was, he will pick up the bill and pay the price for all our mess and mistakes. At Last Supper, Jesus utters those two haunting words. Remember me. When I've gone, remember me. Remember my love. Remember it by living a life of love. <laughs>